There's a horse farm in Gray that specializes in helping children and young adults in a very unique way. Brave Meadows is a place where the horses are used for therapy, and it's only for those who have special needs. In tonight's Making Middle Georgia Great segment, we introduce you to the one-of-a-kind farm and the woman behind Brave Meadows. 41 NBC's Kaya Warnke has the story. On the outskirts of town sits a quiet little farm full of beauty. We have to pick his feet and stuff. Maybe only the most hardy can appreciate. They're very kind animals. The horses need brushing, gives me something to do. feeding, <laughs> and riding. But the group here today, and Bobby's balance has gotten so much better, Good, is learning more than just harnessing <laughs> horsepower. Since he started riding, he's gotten a lot more confident. He's willing to try different things. And Josette's son Riyadh was born with autism. It's not just autism. It's there's a lot of other anxiety issues, different things that go along with autism and it's helped him feel more confident and to try new things. New things like brush and feed a horse. And then you have to put the saddle on. And teach them how to listen to him. That's the only only animal I would prefer to have is a horse. Pull this, pull your right rein. Shannon Milner is the yeah, woman who makes all this rein. possible. So I just, had something that I've always wanted to do. Say what? She's been there running Brave Meadows for about Good five job. years now. I love horses and I love teaching. Come on, hop on. But hopes to teach more than just how to saddle up. There we go, perfect. What I focus on is boosting self-esteem and I love helping anyone with special needs. To see the benefits, to see the, the kids, see the families and see the parents light up when they see their child doing something. <laughs> light up? Yeah, I'd say so. It's important that um, he gets to spend a lot of time being a normal kid and coming out here and getting dirty and nasty and helping water and feed and, you know, do different pro uh, projects and just be a, a typical boy. It's just important. The number one is um, positive um, self-esteem, self-confidence, and that's what I've seen with most of the children and young adults through therapeutic riding. In gray, Kyle Warnke. I think he's giving, yep, he's kissing the camera. <laughs> 41. Tabs, don't slap her out. Don't slap her on me. NBC News. Shannon says she can always use some volunteers to help out around the farm. Also, if horse therapy at Broad Meadows is something you'd like to look into, either to utilize or support, just head to our website at 41NBC.com.